Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Super Kaiba One, and today I want to go over one of the best item farms in the Outriders demo. And this farm seems like it's going to be the best way to farm legendary items in the demo. And with the demo being capped at world tier 5 and our characters at level 7, it's still very rare to get a legendary item, but some people have been getting them. And from what I've heard, seeing people talk on Reddit and different forums and stuff like that, is that looting chests seems to be the best way and the highest chance to get a legendary item. And this farm is built around that. So for this farm, you're going to be farming the side quest A Bad Day, which starts in the town. You essentially just go pick it up, get used to spamming skip scenes so you can get through the dialogue much quicker. And then after you pick up the quest, you're going to take the path I take. You don't have to fast travel anywhere. Then once you get into the mission area, you're just going to go through and kill the enemies as quickly as you can. And there's going to be three chests in this side mission area. Just watch the footage. It's much easier for you to watch and see where I go to loot the chests. There's one right at the start one to close to the end and then the last one is after the ending dialogue and it will be sitting right in front of you and this will give you three chests to loot in probably a little under five minutes and another good thing about this farm is that the chests refresh correctly every time you complete that side quest and then pick it up to repeat it again because a lot of the other chests throughout the game seem to have a cooldown so they're not always there but this one every single time i've redone it no matter how fast or how slow i do the mission the chests are fully respawned in there so you can get them every single time and get just tons of loot and I would recommend getting yourself to level 7 and getting up to world tier 5 before doing this farm so you can have the highest chance to get legendary items. So that is the entirety of the farm I wanted to show you guys today. Let me know if you guys get any legendaries from this. They still seem to be an incredibly low drop chance, but this seems like it will be the best way to actually farm those legendaries. So subscribe if you want to see more Outriders or other videos. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below what you guys think about this farm. And thanks for watching. Come see what wonders I have for sale. Another time, mister. I'm having one shitty day. Uh, Bitter wind blows for us all. Come, how about a little hot tea? Not much of an inventory. Uh, don't mind all these crap on it, one. I keep all the good stuff. Should have paid, old man! <laughs> Think I care? He was about to show me the good stuff. He's just acting on orders. Whose orders? Barker, uh, he runs the Hounds gang. He's trying to take out all the vendors in Rift Town. It won't work for him. <sighs> First fucking day. Thanks again for getting Grand Marshal. Hey, Shira. I got some business in Hound's territory. What can you tell me about their leader, this guy Barker? He fights dirty, preys on the innocent. His men are loyal because they're terrified of him. And you let this guy run things inside your walls? He's too well fortified. The Hound's hideout. Barker will be down here somewhere.
Good to see you again. You'll be pleased to know oh. that. Hey, Shira. I got some business in Hound's territory. What can you tell me about their leader, this guy Barker? He fights dirty, preys on the innocent. His men are loyal because they're terrified of them. Did you let this guy run things inside your walls? He's too well fortified. Hideout. Barkley. Hideout. 